So the first thing you'll probably notice is that it's gone. It's gone. Oh, my face. My face is back! Compared to how it felt before, my face now feels like a baby's bottom. That is how smooth it is right now. And if you reworded some of the words in that sentence, that would just sound terrible. It doesn't even feel like a regular baby's bottom. It literally feels like all of the smoothest baby's bottoms in the world have come together in a baby's bottom smoothness championships and the winner has had sex with second place. They've had a baby and that baby's bum, that's what my face feels like right now, it is absolutely glorious. It is just, it's the nicest thing I've ever felt. Gary Gooch. Gary Gooch. Wow. Look at that for a gamer tag, man. You know, there are some interesting ones out there. But Gary Gooch is pretty, uh, pretty high up on that list. Today is also Black Friday, aka the day where everyone goes crazy and just starts jumping on top of each other in supermarkets. But literally, Black Friday is insanity. I saw a video earlier of a grown woman snatching a kitchen appliance off like a three-year-old girl. I don't know about your priorities in life, but if you have to snatch kitchen appliances off three-year-old girls just because it's got a 20% discount, I think you need to question yourself. I think you need to take a long, hard look at yourself because that, that's, that's just, that's not on the moral high ground, is it? You know, that's a bit below the belt. You know, maybe if it was a thousand pound HD 4K curved 3D TV reduced to 250 pounds and a little three year old was wagging it over her head, showing it off, then yeah, maybe kick that little fucker in the stomach and take it off him. But, you know, a 20 pound fucking blender reduced to 17.99, it's just not worth it, is it? I just think, you know, there's, there's certain things that you would kick a four-year-old in the teeth for, right? And a fucking reduced microwave isn't one of them, do you know what I mean? I don't understand why people are using that locust suppressed. Like, currently, it is as powerful as a potato gun. And you feel the need to put a suppressor on it, which is obviously going to make it weaker still. Mate, enjoy that challenge. The thing that gets me about Black Friday is, it's not just, you know, people going out of their way to just not be themselves and just do ridiculous things like kicking a three-year-old in the teeth and ripping a microwave out of their cold, dead hands. It's just the fact that when it comes down to it, they don't actually need any of the stuff that they're fighting so hard to get. Like, in this clip where the kid, the woman snatches the thing off the kid, the kid's mother already has four of whatever the kitchen appliance is already tucked under her arms. Why are you making your three-year-old kid come out into an obviously dangerous environment carrying the fifth kitchen appliance that you clearly don't need. You know, unless you're doing, you know, trying to cook 17 Rustler's burgers at once at home, I don't think you need that many microwaves, you know what I'm saying? You got people out there like risking their lives because at the end of the day, like in this in this same clip, there were people getting trampled, you know, there was bundles, there was everyone flying about. It, you know, some an accident could happen. People risking their lives throwing themselves in front of trucks just for a £4.99 cutlery set. What, what's the point? You don't need it. It's just a joke. At the end of the day, I think it just comes down to greed. It's all just greed. And greed will be the downfall for the human race. Take it from me.